I was once told that I could not make it, achieve my dreams, or ever be anybody. I was actually told that I would be a statistic. Welcome to Reinvention Tuesdays. Thank you for tuning in for another week of motivation and inspiration. I hope that you're still fired up and encouraged. 2013 is the year of promise. I'm not just telling you that, I'm living that. So 2013 has been a great year, okay? We just received an invitation to head down to Atlanta. In 2014, we're gonna be speaking to 600, over 600 uh, plus teen and young adults and families across the metropolitan area. We also received an invitation to speak to 250 plus people coming up here for a Christmas event, which is gonna be magnificent. The title is, Can You Feel the Spirit? Can You Feel the Spirit? But we'll keep you in the loop on that. Subscribe to our YouTube channel, like our videos. We appreciate your support. But this week, we're talking about kneel, pray, and release. In order to kneel, pray, and release, it takes you understanding what are the three reasons that's going to keep me standing every day? What are the three things that's going to keep me focused? What are the three things that's going to keep me motivated, keep me inspired to continue to press forward? What are those three things for you? I have three things. I have the three things. My three things is God, family, and friends. You know why? Because if I get those three right, if I get that foundation part right, I can help anybody else because I got three things that if somebody knock me down today, that's going to help me keep rising in the morning. It's helping me keep rise. All right. So this week we're saying kneel, pray, and release. All right. When you kneel, that means you're giving up everything. You say, what shall I render? What do I have to give up to get to that next level? What are the things that I have to give up? Last week we said, I am coming out. I am coming out a lot of times in life. Once we do break through the door, once we do walk into our purpose, it's still obstacles. It's still things that are in opposition to our purpose, to our destiny. So in order to get to the next level, you got to say, I got to be. That means that I got to take a knee. I got to get down. I got to give up something. What are you willing to sacrifice? You are the determining factor. You are the one who's going to decide what your journey ends up being. But before you can get there, you got to kneel. What's the next thing? I got to pray. I got to pray. So when you're praying, that means that you're thinking about all the things that you've been going through. All the trials, all the situations, all your circumstances, all the joys of life. Because when you're praying, you're not just asking for things. You're saying, what can I give? What can I do differently? What are the things that I can change about me? All right? thing is release. When you go through life, you got to release your dreams, release your hopes, release your ambitions. All the things that you want to do in life, you got to release it. A lot of times in life, we hold ourselves back. Like I said, we turn it back. We hold ourselves back because we're afraid to release it. A lot of times we tell ourselves, I can't do things. I can't do things. I can't go to college. I can never graduate from high school. Said I can't do it. My family is nobody. My family never did it. I'm telling you, throw all that stuff out the window. All that stuff is over. The thing you have to say is, I am going to win. I am coming out. I'm going to kneel. I'm going to pray and release. Reinvention Tuesday.